What is the neurofeedback protocol for anxiety? I'm Dr. Trish Lee, let me tell you. Okay, so most times, and when I say most, I mean 99 out of 100 times, the brain pattern that causes anxiety is one of too much high beta. So that brain is just using much too much high beta. Sometimes you'll see excessive beta also, and that can be a hyper-focus type of mode. But on a brain map or on a neurofeedback trend screen, if you see that that brain is using much too much high beta, then we know that that brain is stuck in hypervigilant overdrive, stressy anxiety mode. And many people, if they're not diagnosed with an anxiety disorder, many people don't even know their brain is stuck in that mode, but they will feel like their brain is bouncing off the wall. They won't be able to sleep. They won't be able to sit and just relax on the couch for 15 minutes a day. That's how you know that brain is stuck in that mode. Another way that you know is that alpha may be low. And so if alpha is low, it means that that brain can't recover and get into calm mode when it's supposed to calm itself down for a bit of recovery from using all that high beta. Again, it might also cause low delta because that brain is exhausted. So it's low relative delta and sometimes you might have high relative delta because it's an exhausted brain that's in adrenal fatigue but that also can't sleep well at night because it's cranking away. So look for that on the brain map and look for that on the trend screens. The way that you know that you've made progress for someone who struggles with anxiety is that that high beta magnitude comes down and that we see power where we want to see it and there's no longer excessive high beta. Beta's nice and high right where we want it. Alpha's right up there above it so the brain can be in calm focus. So the protocol likely is a decrease in high beta and many times we also decrease theta because they are comorbid patterns. We wanna bump up low beta, possibly SMR, but right there in the middle for calm focus. Okay, I hope this helps you out and remember control your brain or it'll control